let us see the another question the, we already discussed a can do 50 percentage work in 12 days a can do 50 percentage work in 12 days b can do 25 percentage work in 8 days in 8 days a plus b to do complete 100 percentage work together how many days are required how many days are required 50 percentage 12 days if i multiply by 2 100 percentage 24 days 25 multiplied by 4 100 percentage 32 days 100 percentage 32 days if i take 96 units these 4 units per day 3 units per day so 96 by 7 96 by 7 these nothing but 7 13 are 91 13 5 by 7 days 13 5 by 7 days 50 percentage 12 days 100 percentage 24 days 25 percentage 8 days 100 percentage 32 days 25 and 32 convert days into units per day 96 4 are 3 are so 96 by 7 96 by 7 he can give anything sir a can complete two-fifths of the work in 10 days two-fifths of the work b can complete one-third of the work in for example five days if a and b he can give fraction he can give percentage he can give any value a and b together how many days it will be 2 by 5 so this 2 by 5 this side it is 5 by 2 1 by 3 this side it is 3 by 1 these 25 days these 15 days 25 15 it is nothing but 75 units it is 3 units it is 5 units 75 by 3 plus 5 answer is 75 by 8 days it is nothing but 75 by 8 days I hope the idea it is clear 75 by 8 days 10 into 5 by 2 25 5 into 3 by 1 15 so this idea will be 25 15 LCM of 15 and 25 is 75 this is 3 and it is 4 so total 8 units per day 75 units it is 75 by 8 it is 75 by 8. I hope you got the idea of converting days into units per day. Now let us solve some problems. Now see here. First problem. A can do a work in 36 days. A can do a work in 36 days. B can do a work in 32 days. B can do a work in 32 days. So, in one day, he will do 1 by 36. In one day, he will do 1 by 32. If they work on it together for 12 days, together they are working. So, it is 1 by 36 plus 1 by 32. One day, they are working for 12 days. They are working for 12 days. These are nothing but 12 by 36, 1 by 3. 12 by 32, 4 threes are 4 8s are it is 24 so these are nothing but 8 plus 9 17 by 24 work is done 17 by 24 work is done remaining work will be 7 by 24 remaining work is 7 by 24 just understanding how to write it in a fractional approach how to write it in a fractional approach the reason why I am not using percentage method is, sir, can I use percentage? 30 percentage of 24, 7.2, close to 30. These also close to 30. This is also close to 30. All the options are close to 30. So, I avoided percentages. By looking at the answer options, you will get an idea whether percentage. Only if the answer options are far from each other, please write down. If the answer options are far from each other, if the answer options are far from each other, if they are far from each other, use percentage concept. 
यूज परसेंटेज कॉन्सेप्ट इफ द आंसर ऑप्शन आर फार फ्रॉम ईच अदर इफ द आंसर ऑप्शन आर फार फ्रॉम ईच अदर ई होप द आइडिया इट इज क्लियर नाउ दिस ऑलरेडी वी डिड इट ए कैन डू फिफ्टी परसेंटेज दी इज द प्रीवियस इयर एग्जामिनेशन क्वेश्चन सर ए कैन डू फिफ्टी परसेंटेज ऑफ द जॉब इन सिक्सटीन डेज बी कैन डू वन फोर्थ ऑफ द जॉब वन फोर्थ मीन्स ट्वेंटी फिफ्थ परसेंटेज ऑफ द जॉब इन ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंटेज इन ट्वेंटी फोर डेज ट्वेंटी फोर परसेंटेज इन हाउ मेनी वेज कैन ही डू कैन दे डू थ्री फोर्थ ऑफ द जॉब ए प्लस बी टूगेदर ए प्लस बी टूगेदर आई वॉन्ट सेवेंटी फाइव परसेंटेज ऑफ द टोटल वर्क सो दिस विल बिकम हंड्रेड परसेंटेज इट इज नथिंग बट थर्टी टू डेज आर यू ऑल विथ मी हंड्रेड परसेंटेज इट इज नथिंग बट थर्टी टू सो दी इज नथिंग बट सो इफ इट इज हंड्रेड परसेंटेज वन वे इज टू टेक दीज हंड्रेड परसेंटेज ऑल्सो नाइंटी सिक्स सो दिस विल बिकम नाइंटी सिक्स दी इज थ्री यूनिट दी इज वन यूनिट नाइंटी सिक्स बै फोर विच इज ट्वेंटी फोर ट्वेंटी फोर डेज हंड्रेड परसेंटेज इट इज ट्वेंटी फोर यूनिट ट्वेंटी फोर डेज ट्वेंटी फोर डेज ई वॉन्ट सेवेंटी फाइव परसेंटेज सेवेंटी फाइव परसेंटेज सो दी इज नथिंग बट फिफ्टी वै फोर सो सेवेंटी फाइव परसेंटेज सो दी इज नथिंग बट हंड्रेड दी इज ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंटेज इट इज सिक्स डेज Seventy five percentage. It is eighteen days. Answer is nothing but eighteen days. Both of them I converted into hundred and I did it in terms of eighteen days. Ye fifty percentage work in sixteen days. Hundred percentage thirty two days. Twenty five percentage twenty four days. So hundred percentage ninety six days. Both of them are working together. Ninety six by three plus one. Ninety six by four. Twenty four days. Hundred percentage twenty four. Seventy five percentage it is eighteen days. Seventy five percentage it is eighteen days. I hope the idea it is clear, right? Or you can do by using percentage. All are little far. So this is nothing but a can do. Fifty percentage work in sixty days. Fifth half of the work in sixteen days. Hundred percentage work will be thirty-two days. Thirty-two days. So one by thirty-two, it is three percentage. Listen carefully, sir. B twenty-five percentage work in twenty-four days. I want total work hundred percentage. Hundred percentage. It is nothing but one by ninety six days. So one by ninety six is close to one percentage. So together A plus B, I will get four percentage. So four out of hundred. For ninety five, how much it will be? For ninety five, if this value is decreasing. This value will increase, so answer should be just greater than five. So one by twenty-four, four percentage. It is all. It is one by twenty-one is not greater than five. One by eighteen. I hope it is clear, right? These one by twenty-five, sir. If this value is decreasing, this value should also increase. So for hundred, it is four. For ninety-five, how much it is? Ninety-five by hundred into four. Five nineteen zar. Five twenty zar. Seventy-six by twenty. I hope the idea it is clear. Idea it is clear, right? So answer is one by eighteen. With this we got it for hundred percentage. Hundred percentage it is four. Hundred percentage it is four. Seventy-five percentage, not ninety-five, sir. Seventy-five percentage. How much it is? So twenty-five threes are twenty-five fours are. From their calculation, you will get it easily. You are getting answer is eighteen. Easy question. Next one. P can do one fourth of the work in ten days. One fourth work. Total work he will do it in forty days. 
1 by 4, 1, it will become into 4 by 1. Q can do 40 percentage, 2 fifth work. So, it will become 2, 15 into 5 by 2, 75 by 2, 37.5. Q will do 37.5 days to complete the work. One third work, it will become into 3 by 1. So, R will do 39 days to complete the work. Yes, 37.5, 3 by 8, it will become 18 by 3. So, S will become 17 into 8 by 3, which is 136 by 3. These 3 4s are 12, 16, 45 point something. Who is less sufficient? Who takes more days? That person will be more efficient. So, answer is nothing but yes. Answer is nothing but yes. This is a previous year exam question. This is a previous year exam question. I think this question is taken from an SSC CPO examination. This is also a previous year exam question. This is also a previous year exam question. Previous year exam questions. Previous year exam questions. All are previous year exam questions, sir. I hope the idea it is clear. One fourth day work, total work is 4 by 1. Two fifth work, it will become 15 into 5 by 2. One third work into 3 by 1. 37.5, 3 by 8. Here it will be 8 by 3. 8 by 3. So it will take 45. Next one. A alone. Let us do if I can solve this question by using answer options. A alone can do a job in 72 days. A plus B together. A plus B together. It will take 40 days. 40 days is nothing but 1 by 40 which is 2.5 percentage. 2.5 percentage. These 1 by 72. 1 by 72. It is nothing but 1 by 2 into 1 by 2 into 1 by 18. These 1 by 4 into 1 by 18. It is nothing but 1 by 5.18. I already discussed this quadruple. 18, 19, 20, 21. 1 by 20 it is 5. Increase of 0.25. So this will be 5.5. 5.5 .5 by 4. Which is 4 ones are 4. 13. 13. 1.3 approximately. These 1.3. This should give you close to 1.2. 1 by 101. No. These 120. It is no. I hope the idea it is clear right. So these nothing but. 80, 1 by 80, 1 by 18, 200. These 2 5s are 2 4s are. These also no. Answer is 90. Just by looking at a question itself, you are able to tell that the answer is 90 by percentage. 1 by 40 is 2.5. 1 by 72 is 1.3. These is just less than 1.2. Just less than 1.2. 90 into 1.2 is 108. Just less than. 80 into 1.2 is 96. Anyway, 108, 120. All are bigger. All are bigger. I hope the idea it is clear. Or you can do by using answer option. A alone. It is 72 days. A plus B together. It is 40 days. 72, 40. LCM of 40 and 72. If you take, you will get 360. So, it is into 5, it is into 9. So, this will be into 4. Into 4. Something into 4 is 360. So, that value will be 90 days. That value will be 90 days. Easy question. Again, an exam model question. Again, an exam model question. Let us see if there is an any other question which is an can be solved by using answer option let us see a would have taken 12 hours less than b if b takes x days to complete the work b takes x days to complete the work a would have taken 12 hours less so 12 hours less x minus 12 x minus 12 working together 
so in one day it will do 1 by x minus 12 and it is 1 by x they will complete the task in it is given in question 1 by 17.5 how to use answer options to solve this question listen carefully because percentages i am going to use it so how many hours would it take to complete 50 percentage of the task all options are of 50 percentage 18 21 22 and 16 it is 50 percentage 100 percentage options are changed to 36 42 44 and 32 44 and 32 let us see so it is 1 by 17 something 1 by 17 is closer to 5 point percentage if i take 36 1 by 36 minus 12 1 by 24 plus 1 by 36 1 by 36 this is 4 percentage this is around 2 point something so less than 6 there is a possibility that this could be 1 by 21 minus 12 1 by 9 plus 1 by 21 1 by 9 is 11.11 i require 5 to 6 i hope it is clear 1 by 22 minus 12 1 by 10 plus it is 10 plus percentage this cannot be 1 by 16 minus 12 1 by 4 plus 1 by 4 is 25 percentage it cannot be it cannot be i hope the idea it is clear so this is nothing but 1 by 35 by 2 i should get 2 by 35 i should get 2 by 35 check it out whether you are getting the answer that value will be the answer so i hope the idea it is clear i hope the idea it is clear so 1 by 17.5 hours 17 1 by 2 1 by 30 point this is how you can eliminate few answer options so working together a and b a and b can do a job in 40 days you can remove the answer options a and b 40 days b and c you can do it they are completing the work in 36 days a b and c they are completing the work in 24 days let us see if i can use a percentage method 1 by 40 it is 2.5 percentage 1 by 24 i already discussed 1 by 24 1 by 25 these is 4 percentage it is 4.15 percentage these is 4.15 percentage 1 by 36 it is 1 by 2 into 5.5 which is 2.75 percentage 2.75 so if you observe in how many days can b alone do the job let us see if i add both of them these are nothing but 5.25 out of which a plus 2b plus c these 4.15 so answer should be around 1.1 percentage answer should be around 1.1 percentage this cannot be the answer 1 by 60 1 by 60 it is 100 by 60 5 by 3 it is 1 2 by 3 it is 1.6 this cannot be the answer are you all with me 1 by 19 200 10 by 9 1.1 this will be the answer this will be the answer so a plus 2b plus c in that one a plus b plus c is 4.15 by just by if the answer options are quite far from each other you can use this percentage method and quickly eliminate all the incorrect answer options now see here again we will do a can paint a house in 55 days b can paint a house in 66 days 66 days a plus b plus c they can paint a house in 12 days they can paint a house in 12 days easily we will go for it sir these are nothing but 1 by 55 1 by 5 into 1 by 11 lcm method most of you are comfortable so i am just trying to give a different direction these 1.8 these 1 by 66 1 by 6 into 1 by 11 
9.09 by 6. It is 1.5. These is nothing but 1 by 12, 8.3. This is 1.8, this is 1.5, this is nothing but 3.3. This should be closer to 5. 1 by 20 it is closer. Are you all with me? Are you all with me? Instead of taking the LCM of 55 and 66, you can actually use percentage method and make your job easy. 1 by 55 is 1 by 5 into 1 by 11. 1 by 11 is 9.09. This is 1 by 1 1.8. This is 1.5. This is 3.3. 8.3 minus 3.35. Answer should be close to 5%. 15, 25, 30, it is eliminated. Aiken, this is exam, again an previous year examination question. A can dig 1 8th of a part in 20 hours. Okay. This is A. A plus B can dig total part total part it is in 60 hours total part total completely it is one part work work can also be one part how many parts can he dig it in 60 hours Six, 20 hours 60 hours one part 20 hours it is one third so remaining will be 1 by 3 minus 1 by a which is a minus 3 by 3 a Answer options will be there in the form of A. Answer is A minus 3 by 3 A. I hope the idea it is clear. B alone, B alone, B alone. So what you can do is, probably what you can do is, A is, you take A as a 2. Half of the part in 20 hours. So total it is 40 hours. B it is nothing but A plus B. Okay, A plus B is 60 hours. A plus B 60 hours means if one is filling the tank, another adds, the value will decrease, right? So, I will take 4. Why I am taking 4? I hope it is clear. Half if I am taking. A only can filling the tank in 40 hours. If a B is added, the value will be less than 40. If it is A 4, A can fill the tank in 80 hours. A plus B it is in 60 hours. So, 240. These are nothing but 3 and 2. Answer should be 240. Check by using answer options. Check by using answer option. You will get the answer very easily. 